Tonight from our ABC 7i team, allegations of widespread torture involving drug suspects in Mexico. These explosive charges filed in Chicago federal court today by an accused aide to the drug lord known as El Chapo. We have more now from Eyewitness News investigative reporter Chuck Gowdy. Chuck. Alan Jesus Raul Beltran Leon is a former henchman in El Chapo's Sinaloa drug cartel. Tonight, Beltran Leon alleges a campaign of torture against drug suspects by the Mexican military with the blessing of U.S. officials. The charges in a new court filing outline more than a dozen cases of alleged torture. The I team first reported on Beltran Leon's allegations last summer. Now, his attorneys have filed a motion asking prosecutors to turn over the records. The firepower of Mexican Marines on a drug cartel raid. This branch of the Mexican Navy is America's key partner in the drug war south of the border. But tonight, this man, Jesus Raul Beltran Leon, says Mexican Marines and their U.S. counterparts tortured him. And his attorneys have now filed these court papers in Chicago detailing 16 similar cases, including this photo of a female drug suspect allegedly being tortured by Mexican drug investigators. Beltran Leon is being held here at the MCC Chicago and is charged in the trafficking case against drug lord Joaquin El Chapo Guzman. His lawyers filing this motion in Chicago federal court asking the U.S. government to turn over evidence related to his torture and psychological abuse while in the custody of Mexican authorities at the behest of the United States government. As the I-Team first reported last June, Beltran Leon says he was repeatedly tortured and humiliated by masked members of the Mexican Marines after being arrested in November 2014. In this affidavit also filed today, Beltran Leon recounts how he was shocked with electrodes, subject to water torture, and that his wife, baby daughter, and mother were threatened with gang rape and murder. He said his abductors held him down, placed plastic bags over his face, and began to asphyxiate him while others punched him in the abdomen. The 33-year-old U.S. citizen claiming several English-speaking Americans were in his home on the official raid team. It was a Mexican Marine unit that arrested El Chapo himself last year after the drug lord was on the run following that prison break in 2014. No comment on this story or the filing today by U.S. officials. Thanks, Chuck.